We're reading from verse 15. Philippians chapter 1. Reading from verse 15. Some indeed preach Christ. If you stop there, you think every preacher is a friend. Every preacher is a supporter. Every preacher is an encourager. Every preacher is a lifter up of our heads. But read everything. Some indeed preach Christ even of envy and strife. They say they are Christians. They say they are ministers. They say they are preachers. I want to listen to them. They want to catch your attention. But then, from what they say, from their utterances, and from the things they blow out, the hot air they blow out, and from their actions, and from everything they put on sight for people to see, you know that they are talking because of envy and because of jealousy and because of carnal, worldly, unrighteous competition. Some indeed preach Christ, even of envy and strife, and some also of good will. Look at verse 16. In verse 16, the one preach Christ of contention. The one preach Christ not of conversion, the one preach Christ, not of turning people's minds unto Christ. The one preach Christ, not to prepare their hearers for heaven. The one preaches Christ, not to show the love and the grace of God available for whosoever will. But they preach Christ of contention. It's like they want to say something that the other preacher will hear and the other preacher will say you said that about me and then I know you too and then they throw another stone back and when the stone hits him he said that's what I expected you to do I wanted you to fight that's why I'm pulling you out of the ministry I'm getting you to the arena where you will fight and then he throws something back and then people are gathering as spectators on the stadium and they are watching two preachers fight somebody started it but if you are saved if you are sanctified if you know your calling you will not reply them because you know there is envy there is jealousy in their camp and it says the one preach christ of contention not sincerely supposing to add affliction to my bonds those are the people by their actions and reaction by their utterance and their preaching by their ministry and their, their you know language insulting language you know that they are false brethren you will not be a false brother i will not be a false brother you'll not be a false sister you'll not be a man a woman of contention in jesus name